Hi, my name is Ron. And my name is LaShawn. Welcome back to the Three Minute Marriage Moment. Today we have a good question, and this is from the listener. We don't know whether it's a male or female, but we have a good answer for you. All right, today's question is, we have been married 13 years, and our sex life is boring. I have begun to look at other people. Just looking, what should I do? Hmm. That's a good, good, good question, Sean. Now, the first thing that you should do is communicate with each other. Yes. That should be the very first and foremost thing to do because you need to find out why are you looking. You know, why are you looking in another direction? For a guy, it could be for different reasons. You know, his spouse may be tied up doing things. He may not be getting the attention or he may be getting attention from other women. That's true. That's true. You know, um... I think that's important to really get an idea of where the the, the lack of intimacy or interest is coming from. Yeah, yeah. And that's good. That. And for a female, I think, you know, sometimes it's about romance or the effort that's put into your lovemaking and not making it the old same old steak and potatoes. Yeah. Same way, same time, same place every night. Sometimes you need to kind of change up your venue. Mm -hmm. um, there are a lot of creative ideas. You know, there are some really good books, you know, that could help also. Yep, and also, women, don't let your re romance be someone else's romance. That's Otherwise, right. Otherwise, be creative with your own romance. Right. Know what you like. Yes. Number two would be what? Would be, hmm. I think, I, you know. Intimacy? I, intimacy, yeah. I think, you know, look, check into your intimacy. Are you talking during the day? Are you kissing anymore? Mm. What is your non-sexual communication like? Because once again, sex starts in the kitchen, not the bedroom. Right. And it doesn't take grabbing it behind or front or anything like that. But you have to love her first. Yes. Or he, even him. You know, guys like to be touched. I know yeah. I like to be touched. I you like do. when you touch my hand, grab my hand. That's your love you know? language. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So I need that. Right. And the third thing is, if you're 35 and over, you know, we have to keep it 100 with you and be real. Sometimes there are physical issues going on or maybe yeah. you have a disease or some yes. type of disability that might be impairing your um, your sex life. And sometimes men are just totally shut down instead of admit that they're having issues. You know, it could be diabetes, it could be high blood pressure, um, some type of medication that you're on. Yep, and even for the women, your hormones, you need to get yeah. that checked out. Because I know even for us, we went through that, but we didn't know until we went to a health doctor yeah. and we found out these issues. And praise God, once we found out, hey, we started dealing with it. Yeah. So you need to pray, you need to communicate, and also you need to have great intimacy. Yes. And then three, get your health checked out. Don't give up so soon. 13 years is a short time in the, in the, in the span of your lifetime together. And we got a lifetime together to practice this and make it work. So thank you again for coming, listening to Three Minute Marriage Moment. But what you could do, you want to get us back with us at www.songsofsolomonri.com. Or hit us up on Facebook at Songs of Solomon Marriage Ministry. Mar I'm sorry, Songs of Solomon <laughs> Relationship Institute. We changed the name, so just... They know what you mean. Okay. Okay. God bless. Peace out. Peace.